What's growing on, gardeners? On today's Two Minute Garden Tip, I'm going to show you how to make your seedlings and transplants grow faster in cooler fall weather. Back in early September, I started a new planting of cucumber plants because at that point I was two and a half months away from our first frost and that is usually more than enough time to get a decent harvest out of cucumber plants as long as everything went according to plan. But then disaster struck. Tropical storm Ophelia hit us dead on a week ago and leading up to the storm and ever since we have had weather that's been almost 15 degrees below average every single day with persistent cloud cover. This is not what we're used to at this time of the year. It feels more like the beginning of November than the end of September. And because it's been so cool and cloudy, all of my plants have been set back big time. They are barely budging in this chilly weather. So I knew that I had to do something to warm up my plants so they would get back on track and grow faster. Otherwise, I'm going to run out of time and I'm not going to get a harvest. And then it hit me. I will just do in the fall what I do to my seedlings in the spring. And that solution are my trusty milk jug greenhouses. All these are are one gallon water jugs that I cut the bottoms off of and then I use them to place on top of my transplants or seedlings to artificially capture the sunlight and have a greenhouse effect to make it warmer around the plants. But because I leave the caps off, that allows venting of excess heat so it's not going to get so hot that it cooks the plants. So it's the perfect balance to make things warmer without harming the plants. It works great in the spring, so why not in the fall too? And that's exactly what you see right here. These cucumber seedlings broke ground, but they've been struggling, not moving at all, because it's just been too cool these past two weeks overall. But now that we have these milk jug greenhouses on our seedlings, the extra warmth is starting to produce some results. So let's remove one of these water jug greenhouses and we will see the results underneath. When I placed this milk jug greenhouse on the seedling, all it had were the two leaves that are used to break through the soil. But now I have a true leaf here and I have another true leaf that is starting right here. And this one looks just as good. I'm getting a true leaf here and a new one there. And this last one, this also has true leaves. A second one is starting right below it. Now the leaves are not as green as I want them to be. That's probably because of the cooler temperatures causing nutrient uptake issues, but we'll give them a little bit of fish emulsion and then we will place these greenhouses back on top of them. Next week, we're supposed to have warmer, more seasonable temperatures. So between the greenhouse effect of the milk jugs, the water soluble fertilizers and getting back to normal temperatures, they should green right back up and start growing quickly again. And now the milk jugs are back on where they will stay until it comes time to fertilize them again or they outgrow the milk jugs and it comes time to trellis them up on this cable that I have hanging right here. And this method isn't just beneficial for warm weather plants like tomatoes, cucumbers, peppers, and squash. You can use them to boost the growth on your brassicas and lettuces as well. If it gets unseasonably too cold too quickly, just make sure if you use them and you do get a warm up, you may want to make sure that you take them off in the warmer periods because some of these plants are prone to bolting if it gets too hot too quickly. So make sure you think things through and constantly monitor the temperatures. And that's today's two minute garden tip. If you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing and hitting the bell to receive new video notifications and check out our Amazon storefront and spread shop in the video description for a list of the gardening products I use and awesome custom designed apparel and other gear. Your support is greatly appreciated.